raining. Uh, good day to wash tobacco. Um, I'm soaked with water and grease anyway, so I figure what the heck, might as well get out here and clean it, get it clean. Um, I don't know if you've ever washed tobacco, but <laughs> you end up with a lot of these little grease dingleberries everywhere. So, this is uh, mighty fun. You just chase them around until you get them all gone. If somebody knows of a better way to do it, I'd sure like to know, but I mean, I've tried scraping as much as I can off of it, but whenever you start blasting around the joints and pivots, there's no way you can, um, there's no way you can keep it from blowing off. Uh, you got the loader front end pretty much clean. Looks a little better. Well, you gotta love this uh, job sometimes. I'm working by the air. I've been pissing it and dirt around the building. Um, eh, not all day. I've done, I've probably spent an hour and a half or two hauling dirt just, just around the building. But I just got stopped by one of the, all the bosses out here, GCs, and he said that we, we dug a, we dug a hole yesterday for a, um, I call it a grease, a grease trap or a oil, oil, yeah, it's, actually it's just a grease trap. They use them on kitchens to keep kitchen waste from going into the sewer. Uh, they'll have a separate sewer line. But anyway, most of this dirt in this pile here came out of that hole around in the front of the building, which uh, I think I should have some footage of the trip around there. It's about a quarter mile, probably. And uh, anyway, just just got word that uh, what they're going to do now is fill the hole back in and drill piers. So <laughs> anyway, I get to I get to work a little later today. There's my camera out there on the boom. I need to pull it pull it off. But anyway, pretty funny deal. Sometimes um, you just can't, you know. One reason I like working by the hours, it really don't matter to me. I'll haul this dirt back uh, gladly. I mean, now I make money moving dirt.
being sold out yesterday. I moved all that dirt around to the other side of the job. When we dug this hole, there was, I told them it's kind of soft down there in the bottom. I said, you guys might want to look at this. And uh, they're setting a grease trap in there. So they don't want to send it. So I guess between yesterday and today, or this afternoon, the architect or the engineer decided that the best thing they could do would be to drill piers and set the tank on piers. I have never seen that done before in my life, but um, anyway, so I was just about done hauling my dirt pile off and they turned me around and started, I started hauling it back. So. Now I'm taking some rock over. We got a small grease trap set on the other side over here. I'm taking some, some rock over to it. And uh, this is turning out to be a pretty big day. I thought I was going to be done a little bit early today. But anyway, that's okay. I've just been riding around, bouncing up and down the road. Not wasting trips or anyway. So. 